1022, welcome back. Well, National Donut Day is tomorrow, and today we are celebrating the bravery of the Salvation Army Donut Lassies. They were a group of women who actually helped popularize the donut back in 1917. We are joined live by two members of the Salvation Army, Major Michael Leroux and Cameron Formica. She is donor relations specialist who is gracious enough to dress as an actual donut lassie this morning. Thank you guys so much for being yeah, here. No, thank you for having us. So this is, I know National Donut Day is the first Friday mm -hmm. of the month, but tell us how this ties in with the Salvation Army. Yeah, so as you shared, in 1917, the Salvation Army sent uh, a group of young women over to the trenches in France to support our service members that were working and and really protecting America and protecting our rights uh, in the front lines and so they wanted to offer hope and so they they kind of pulled together just the the materials they needed to make donuts and they even uh, it, it's fascinating they used spent artillery shells and wine bottles as rolling pins to roll out donuts. And so they, they found a helmet, they used that to boil the oil and to make the, to fry the donuts. So, so um, that happened in 1917 and then 1938, the Salvation Army uh, started a donut day as a way to connect the hope that was being offered to those on the front lines, to those that were really the front lines and shifted to America during the Great Depression. And uh, ever since then, people have been connecting these sweet trees to hope. I love it. And of course, you know, people get excited when they see donuts, but what do you really want them to think about when they see these treats uh, in connection to the salvation? Yeah. Story? Yeah. So our prayer is that, that they, when they see these donuts, when they have donuts tomorrow and all kinds of places are offering donuts, is that they make the connection to hope hope and, and that the Salvation Army is there, that there is hope that's provided. The front lines, then it was it, the trenches in France. But now the front lines very, very often are the lines in the grocery stores. It's the tables as people are trying to figure out, how do I pay this utility bill? How do I pay this? Those are the front lines now. And the Salvation Army, just as we were then, is there now offering hope. So every time they have one of these donuts, like some of these from our great partner in Lyman Orchards, um, we hope that they make the connection that there is hope available. And they smell delicious. Yes. If you can't <laughs> smell through the screen, we wish smell vision existed, yeah. but they smell <laughs> yeah. great. Uh, tell us a bit about the Salvation Army and the work that you do throughout the year. Yeah, yeah, so throughout the year, our mission really is to meet human needs in Christ's name without discrimination. So whatever those needs are, uh, basic material needs, sheltering, um, utility assistance, food assistance, um, that's, that's our, our, our audience that we serve, that we uh, meet, and, uh, and, and the need is increasing. Uh, with inflation going up and everything else, food insecurity has really become a, a, a real issue for many people. And for many people that it wasn't a reality for a couple of years ago, it's now, now an issue. And so um, even last year, we served over 1.2 million meals throughout the state of Connecticut. And so a lot of those people are new people that didn't look for help before. So those are the those are some of the ways that the Salvation Army is really identifying and meeting human needs wherever it's wherever it is. It is amazing the work that you do. Are there any ways that people can help you throughout the year? Yeah, absolutely. So there's a number of different ways. We're always looking for volunteers. We're always looking for obviously financial support. But uh, if you go to our website, SalvationArmyCT.org, you'll be able to be connected with your local Salvation Army and see a wide range of ways that you can help support the work that we do. Wonderful. And we have that website up on screen, SalvationArmyCT.org. Thank you for introducing us to Donut Day, the Donut Lassie yes. uniform. <laughs> we love to see it brought back to yes. life. Thank you so much for your time today. No, thank you so much.